That's too much. I, I love the tradition in Pokemon of paying people for beating you up. Yeah, I thought that was kind of funny too. You just punch people till the lunch money falls out. Well, I think it's like it's gambling, but they yeah. can't say it's gambling. Gambling on animal fights is not like. Meanwhile, the first Pokemon had like an actual casino. Yeah, and they got rid of that. The other, they got rid of that in the remake. So did they? Yeah. And then the other remake, and then the other other remake. How many times? Did they, how many times have they made red yet? I don't know. Well, no, wait. I don't. I don't know how many times. There's but... a, the, so Ruby was not red, right? Uh, yeah. No, but then there was Omega Red, or Fire Red, or something. Well, Fire Red. Oh, I know. There's Omega Ruby. Omega Ruby. So they remade the Ruby also. Yeah, yeah. They but no, they had, they had Fire Red, Fire and then red, they had then they cream. then they had Eevee and, and Pikachu, which mm -hmm. are remakes of Red and Blue. Yes. You, are, you start off in Pallet Town, yeah. and then you challenge the Elite Four. It's the first 150 Pokemon, all that. So um, they kind of. But it has Mega Evolutions, but only for the starters and Mewtwo. Well, only certain Pokemon get Mega Evolutions anyway, regardless yeah, of what game you're in. But it only has four or five, because there's well, two for Charizard and two for Mewtwo. I Mewtwo's hate six. all of them, so I don't even care. Well. I think I remember liking Mega Mega Ultra Venusaur. I don't like it. I'm Deluxe not. Deluxe edition. I'll do Mega Evolutions for Pokemon I don't care about, but I'm never going to do Mega Evolution of Venusaur or Gyarados or anything that I like. You don't, you don't like that Pokemon adopted a, or Digi a Digimon story element? All my cool, all my favorite ones are the ones <laughs> they, that get they it. They stole Mega Evolutions from Digimon. <laughs> That's how every Digimon works. Don't worry about Digimon. <laughs> Digimon. <laughs> well, that was a shock. No, that was a grass type. Oh my gosh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Guess I know why Lee thought he should give you a Pokemon too. Don't be so salty. You and your Pokemon all fought hard, but shitty. <laughs> <laughs> Made me almost want to let out Charizard and join in on the fun. That would be for really, a homicide. That'd be really cruel to do that. Good effort out there, Grookey. Why don't I get you all sorted? And Keithany, you've got real promise. In fact, I've got a favor to ask you. I can't ask my brother because he sucks. Be a real rival to Hop, would you? Push him and make the both of you stronger. That's embarrassing for Hop. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> just staring. <laughs> I just want to look at my brother's face for a long time because I love him. <laughs> How do you want to get stronger and stronger? You see me battle now, Lee, so come on. You've got to let me take on the Pokemon gyms. You join the gym challenge? You think you're ready for the single greatest competition in the Galar region? Your brother's mean to you. Not putting the cart before the Rapidash here, little Rapid, little brother. He, he, he. Rapidash is a horse. If that's really what you want to do, then you have a lot uh, you need to, to learn about Pokemon. Especially your friend Kitani. Before you think about getting gym battle badges, best to think about getting a Pokedex. Give me one. A trainer's Pokedex helps them learn lots of things about all the Pokemon out there, including their strengths. But it's more than just a collection of data, you know. It's a record of a trainer's love and passion. For Pokemon training. <laughs> right, right, we get it. Pokedex is dead. We're on it. Calm down, buddy. Looks like it's off to the Pokemon Research Lab for you and me, Keith and E. This guy's a lot. He's, he's a calm it. <laughs> it's the kind of enthusiasm a trainer needs. I'll let the professor know what to expect you. I want to see what what tree the professor is. What tree the professor? You're so excited about what tree it's going to be. I am. Has there already been a Birch? Yes. Yeah. That, okay. When I first met Birch, I thought he was named after Professor Birch. Yeah. That was my first thing. And when I met Kiba, I thought he was named after Naruto. Yeah. Both yeah. of those things are not true. <laughs> I'm gonna be the next champion, so completing a simple Pokedex will be nothing. Get over yourself, <laughs> boy. This is the page in the tale of my legend. You probably better go tell your mom that we're headed out, though. Yeah, go. So that's, that's the thing. Go is, tell like, your mom, you loser. Well, we're like a bunch of kids. Whoa. And we're just, like, oh no. Team Rocket has murdered our family. Me. Did you hear that just now? They captured my mother. <laughs> You just, you just see, like, a flying Pokemon. <laughs> oh no, the Wooloo got out! The gate's open, and the Wooloo that was there... Oh no. ...is not there You're anymore. You're completely inept. 
Yeah, just telling the, the Wooloo to not do that didn't work. Yeah, and then we just walked away. It was, Meanwhile, this poor Wooloo is like in captivity so hard that it's like, I prefer death to servitude, and it's just like bashing its head against the wall. The poor the fucking times. Wooloo. <laughs> it was tackling the fence pretty hard earlier. You don't think it actually broke through there? Yes, I do. Do you? Yes, I do. He's never but it's off limits. No one's supposed to go in there. I remember the professor's granddaughter went in once. She came back in a real state. How could we ever go into the spooky forest when we're gonna be Pokemon masters? <laughs> yeah, you gotta go to fucking. Uh... It's like, dude, we're gonna go into like some kind of like fucking cemetery tower at, at some point, probably. Like, yeah, Labrador Town, dude. You better step up. <laughs> And that was nothing compared to the earful she got from the professor afterwards. She's more worried about getting in trouble. Keithany, what do you say? We gotta... Of course. We've got to save it. Right? Even if we're not supposed to, this is the kind of scene where you simply have to do what's needed. He's taking the credit for the my bravery. Hope you're ready yeah. for anything. Because we're going in, Keithany. Don't act like this was your idea. I don't like this creepy fucking <clears throat> pink face mouth creepy thing. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, he's, his, he's, his smile is his toothless smile where it's or just a weird boomerang of pink flesh is creepy to look at. He smirked at us. That, that's beautiful. That fog. That's nice to look at. That Wooloo. Where do you think it got off to? His Wooloo I assume Wooloo's new. Yeah. Because we're in the Shepherd like hills that you'd associate with this region. And so it's like the go-to Pokemon to have. The fog is really coming on thick now. So yeah. You, like you. <laughs> there was like a... Oh my, yeah, for sure. <laughs> there was like a... Um, the internet was like raving about Wooloo. Wooloo. Um, because before there was uh, Flaffy. Flaffy. Yeah. Flaffy's really cute. So there's all these memes about like... Move out of the fl way, Flaffy. I want to look at that Wooloo. Because everyone thinks like Wooloo's way cuter than like Flaffy. shoving its face out of the way. But Flaffy's Flaffy pretty turn, cute. Doesn't Flaffy turn into a terrifying alien monster? I like... I like, um, well, Ampharos is kind of weird. Ampharos is a real weird direction for Oh, no, sorry, sorry, into. sorry. It's Mareep. Oh, Mareep. Mareep, Flaffy. Wait, no, wait. Fuck. Am is I Flaffy the Mareep that sits up? I think it's Flaffy, Mareep, Ampharos. No, Mareep is the little little yellow one. Ampharos is the is the one that looks like a weird draft. Ampharos. Yeah. That one. Ampher oh, God, is that Mega Evolution Ampharos? He's never seen the Mega Evolution of Ampharos. Oh, my God, those luscious locks. P people think he looks like, um. He's the final form of Mareep. Yeah, Mareep's the baby. It's and Flaffy. If it's Mareep, then it's Flaffy. I actually think and Flaffy is the cutest with of all glorious three of them. hair. Oh, my um, God, Mega Evolution is a. Mega Evolution was a mistake. I Thank you. <laughs> I know. Why does that one evolve? <laughs> Go look up, uh, go look up like Salamence's Mega Evolution right now. Salamence Mega yeah, Evolution. Yeah, just look up. I don't. Eh. Salamence. Ha ha ha! Mega oh wait, I don't have any Pokeballs yet. You loser. What the? It's. Why didn't you? Why didn't you go get that one Pokeball in the corner that you didn't get? She's into a frisbee. What? What is? Where does his limbs go? He's supposed to get a frisbee. Sorry, I had to show uh, Keith. What so, the fuck? So he looks like that normally, and then he turns into like the frisbee. I, I need a palate cleanser. Mega Evolution Mighty Okay, nah. good. Don't look up Gyarados. Yeah, he's radical. No. Is that him? That's him. Look That's at, stupid. He looks the weird. <laughs> Why does the art look weird? Isn't that the real one? Uh I don't know. Let's go to the real wiki. This is distracting and off topic. How you guys doing, everyone at home? Yeah, sorry. Okay. Yeah, this, yeah, he looks cool. It's shiny. That's, that's, mega. that's shiny. That's shiny. But that's mega. Yeah, but still shiny. Yeah, but it's mega. Whatever. Okay. Whatever. He... Yeah, mega mighty Ena looks fine. Okay. He look. He just looks like a third evolution that they didn't get for some reason. Stupid. I don't like that's it. That's not bad. That's he doesn't look stupid. If you wanted to be in the game, he, he, make it, was, it the it next was, evolution. It wasn't the weird dumb anime we saw a second ago on the, on the image search. But yeah, he does look like he's just a third evolution that they didn't give him for some reason. Just give him that then. <laughs> yeah, in this game. He can also join the glam make rock it a band. Weird, a weird temporary <laughs> Mega Mighty Nina can also join the glam rock band. Do you think this thing's He'll be cute? the guitarist. Oh my god, I just saw it for the first- You just popped his cheek. <laughs> he was like, yeah. Look, look at him trying to get me with Tail what Whip. What the fuck? Look at him. I don't have any Pokeballs, so I can't catch him or anything. He's precious. Murder I don't, him. Right? No, I don't. Do a kill on him in the face. <laughs> Will do. Until he's a dead. So it's gonna be boring for a bit because it's the only move I really have that's any good. No, that's just what the combat always looks like. I know. <laughs> well, well, eventually we'll get cool moves. They'll wobble differently. 
I had a um Oh, uh, a, Are we hiding? A wiggly tough that learned like dig and punch and stuff, and it was the hila most hilarious animations ever. I thought it was oh. so funny that I took him to the Elite Four, and uh, he well, kicked ass. I named him Kibi. Wait, is this how you always walk in the in the grass? I don't know why I was creeping. The fuck was that? Who was that? Hi. Is that Hop? Wait, oh, yeah. Oh, I don't want to talk to you. <laughs> you. You fell for him. Oh. Oh, he healed. Oh, he healed. He healed Grookey. Well, I didn't. Wasn't even, I wasn't, how is he doing that? I was not even hurt. So fuck you. He's, he just wanted to touch my Grookey. <laughs> you, Rookity! Rookity! Yeah, he's kind of cute. It's just a little ball bird. It's weird how his pupils is go that... into his eyelids. That's a little confusing. Is that what the... Is he what the wind vane was? No, no, he, no, that was a, for sure a... That was a previous Pokemon? Fleshling, yeah. Um... Look at the little shit. I don't remember... You know what, I think... I'm trying to remember if... I think grass might be not effective against... Uh, flying. I'm gonna forget. Just make some sure of this you don't lose too. to a paralyzed Taylor. Well, we'll see if it's super effective. Yeah, see, yeah. Wow, so, it's so, it's super effective. So Peck is a flying type Dang. move, so <laughs> it's super effective because uh, flying's effective against grass. I think. I just I I really like those messages where it's like it's super effective and it does no damage, and then you one shot somebody. It's like it's not very effective. <laughs> well, that's what we get when you're OP. <laughs> cool. Boop, 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 do, 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 do. Okay, so we gotta cover our That's bases. Familiar. We're gonna need like we have a grass. I think I think Rookie's only a grass type. But I should check. Um. Oh. We need some dual types. <gasps> what was that? We're gonna be a dog type. We're gonna be a dog type. You I hear hope that? So. That was a, that was a howl. If, wasn't we, it? if we find a dog type, we'll catch it because yeah. it's his favorite. Watch oh. it be the dumbest looking oh. dog type I've ever seen. The, 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 he'll still be a good boy. Is that it? Nope, that's an idiot. <laughs> I don't like that at all. That's just a weird little idiot monster. I think a lot of people are gonna be like- It's a squalvit. Oh. Oh. <laughs> it's a squalvit. Squalvit? What a name! Squalvit? He's a squalvit. He's a squalvit. He's a squalvit. I just re- Oh, you know what? I just realized if oh, you already- it says effective right If you there. fought it already, it tells you if it's effective or it's not. It's like, like Persona. See, I think that's cheating. I don't like that because- I like, I like, like, in the old game where I have to, like, back in the day, I have to, like... No, I just click on the thing the game tells you is the right answer. I have to, like, pull up my chart. I have, like, a chart. I have to pull up my chart and look at it to, like, remember some of these. And, and then... Well, your defense fell. That's gonna be a real problem if you ever get to consist another turn. Whoops. <laughs> and then, like, um, it wouldn't tell you what type the Pokemon was, so you have to, like, kind of guess what the moves it was using. And then, too, so yeah. I have to be, like... And what color to, like, it is, probably. I have to, like, look up what type it was. Well, some of them are really misleading. Yeah. Like, Gyarados is not a dragon type. But he can, like, learn ice moves. Some of them, I think. Can Gyarados learn any dragon moves? Yes, he learns dragon rage. Because that's what's confusing, is, like, you have, like, fairies that use dragon attacks and stuff, and well, I'm like, I don't know what things well, mean. Well, fairies wouldn't exist until very recently. And I still don't know what a dragon type means. That's, like, how do you do a dragon attack, anyway? So, back... Like, back... fire, I understand, as an element, but fairy and dragon, I'm like, you're making things up. Okay, so fairy... Bullshit to fairy because so fairy didn't exist for a long time a long time like up yeah. until very recently Even though tons of fairy Pokemon did they just weren't fairies dragon was OP and could only be beat by other dragons or ice And there was only like one dragon Pokemon in like the first game Well, there's, there was a few but but the thing is is that the reason they were worth it is because they took so long to level up That and they, you got them so late in the game that it was worth doing because I, I think you're getting rushed Oh, like fuck. You, stood, you stood still for too long. How dare you? I care more about the Pokemon than you. I don't think it's that. I think they it's just, charge I think head it's first a... into the mist and get chomped on. I think it, we're just he's just periodically going to talk to us because we have to pretend like we're friends. Uh, uh, it might just be the music. I think it's just. I thought I heard a howl, but there's just like a weird like ghost music going on. No, You're not reading dialogue. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm just so I care about that Wulu so much. So foggy, I can't see the hand on my face. What? We just walked in on the fucking, like, fucking cover of the box legendary. It, that's what happens in the intro. Your reaction is the same as Hop's. <laughs> <laughs> what in the... <Go. laughs> that's a weird way to, to try to automatopoeia a roar. Oh, you're fucked. Well, he's not gonna fight us. You're so boned. He's, I, gonna, he's it, gonna run away it, or it something. It does straight up not even have a sword. He actually looks pretty he's, intimidating. Oh, his tail- his- his- his, his ears, ears cut off. off. He's cool looking. Should I try or should I run? Uh, no, I'm, I'm gonna try it. Poke. I just poke him with a stick. 
Oh. All right. <laughs> He's cool looking. What? The move had no effect on it. It's too. Look at this, 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 this howling theme. This is actually pretty, a pretty jazzy. This Legend of Zelda ass sounding fucking howling theme. Oh, he's gonna disappear on us. Oh no, no. Keithany, I can't see anything. Are you okay? Hold my hand. Hold, <laughs> Hold my hand. hand. I'm so scared. Hold my hand. I'm gonna growl at him. I'll protect you, Keithany. That's confusing. Whoa. Yeah, he's gone. Spooky. We can still see the little wow. head, the head bobbing around it's on our side. It's weird how they really actually affect the... Usually fog just doesn't, like, do anything. Yeah. Ooh! <laughs> Screen just stays white. Well, that was cool. Like, usually it doesn't actually, like, affect our ability to do anything as the player. The legendary it's has its cool. own theme song now. Oh, they, I think they have before. Have they? I think so. I always played, back when I played Pokemon, it was on mute anyway, because it was so far back. It was on Game Boy and it would be annoying and loud. You gotta, you gotta play your character. Oh, oh, they're here. Hop. Keith and Eight. That was a Pokemon that's even cooler than anything she, he has access to, that loser. With his... Ooh. Uh, what? Lee? How did you manage to find your way here? He even wears one of those an annoying, like, oversized baseball caps that he wears wrong. Your pants with directions. You always get lost? What does that mean? Your pants with directions. What? You don't know what that means? No. Pants is an insult. Calling someone pants? Yeah. Yeah. What? I've never heard this before. Your pants. You're you're a wait, you're a pants? Hank, you're a pants. Now shut up and go what? You can't look out Irv Nick's. Yeah, that was just a thing that happened. Calling something pants. No, don't look up. More Irvin dictionary. I think you're making this up. No, I'm not making no. You just have to get past all the ones that are referring to pantsing people. Which is all of the problem. It's probably every single. Yeah, like that's pants. I don't know. Uh, I always get lost. It's though. just it's hard. It's hard to look this up because there's so many things right here. Yeah, see, like man, that's pants. I didn't get the right software. Urban six. It's it's just this is the saying for no good. That's no good. Just gonna keep looking at at mega evolved Puccina. I'm letting them read the, the text Of course. Themselves. I came looking for the both of you. Wait, where's the Wooloo? We we're trying to rescue that Wooloo. This one is no little woo 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 Meh. It's the woo woo. Little chap. Little, little chap. chap's just fine. This I can't get over the slang. It's driving me crazy. But all of you had fainted by the time I found you here. Look at that cute little- Wulu is actually pretty cute. You know, this place is out of bounds. But it took courage to come in here all the same. And I can understand well enough why you did it. Um, it was my idea and that other kid just wanted to act cool and so he took my idea, okay? You did good, Hop. You no. Know, he- this was none of his choice. And at least that Wulu's alright. Look at right. him smirking! The little- Yeah. Little Little punk. At least that wood was all right. Right, Keithany? <laughs> <laughs> I thought we'd had it with that weird fox that are rolling in that mad Pokemon attack. That sick ass Pokemon. But at least it wasn't all for nothing. Attacked by some mad Pokemon? What are you talking about, Hop? It's even loads stronger than any Pokemon I've ever seen. And just had this sort of presence. Whoosh. Our moves cha, cha, didn't cha, even cha. touch it. Our moves. He didn't even try. He didn't even try. He, yeah, he didn't even play. I mean, play. really? Get over yourself. Huh. They seem to pass right through it. Your moves passed right through it. A ghastly, then. 
<laughs> so, the fearsome Pokemon they say live in the slumbering Pokemon? wield. <laughs> Are they actually illusions or something? Self-scope. Get strong enough and maybe the two of you could be the ones to reveal the truth someday. For now, let's simply get out of this place. You'll be alright now that I'm here with you. I don't like either of these boys. Even if we did get an earful from Lee, don't say that in front of him. One experience. This will make a pretty fine first page in the tale of my legend. <laughs> oh, goodness. Don't forget to tell your mom we're off to wedge hers now. She'll go, she'll go spare if you leave without a wor word. Even worse than Lee just said. She'll go spare. Keith's, Keith's gonna look up all the slang we hear. We don't know what the fuck people are saying. Go spare. Urban Dictionary. To get out of control with anger, rage, or frustration. To go berserk. This is a British expression that was in use before World War II. From some, spare meaning excess. Oh, we all thought that Wendy would go you. spare when she found out that Maurice had spent all the rent money buying video games. You can really see the target audience for Urban Dictionary. Yes. With their use of video games. We all, th we all thought that Wendy would go spare. It's kind of cute. I still that... think they're pranking us. Pokemon devs just made up a bunch of fake British And they slang, added them on added Urban Dictionary. added all the Urban Dictionary in advance as a lie. I kind of- they're forcing you, you me to talk to me. my mom. Tum tum! tum. <laughs> okay. Tum tum. <laughs> Alright. Oh, Jesus Christ, don't feed it after midnight. <laughs> tum tum. <laughs> <laughs> well now, isn't Grookey just a sweetheart? That's a Willem de Best, Mom. And yes, I heard the news from young Leon. I'm glad someone bothered to tell me. Off to Wedgehurst, aren't you? I actually wasn't going to tell her. I was going to leave without telling her. <laughs> and they, they didn't let me, so... Just vanish. From, yeah. Vanish from home without a word. Here we are. A bit of pocket money for your journey. A bit Buy of pokey a money? A little poke money. Buy yourself <laughs> a little something at the Pokemon Center. Maybe some potions or something? Don't spend it all in one place. I'm gonna go Thank buy some weed, Mom. Thanks, Mom. I feel like Ruki will battle to the very end for you. So don't go pushing the poor deer too hard. Tom Tom. <laughs> <laughs> and you, Grookey, look after it by little Keithany. Mom, why do you name me Keithany? <laughs> <laughs> it's her fault. She's the one. She's the culprit. Come That's home. why you're running away from home. Yeah, this is why I never to change your name. This is why I disassociate with my family. Come home to rest anytime you need. After all, east or west, home is best. What? No. I refuse to think that anyone says that on purpose. What? Home East west. or west, home is best. Well, she just did it. Ba -doo. Ba -doo. <laughs> ba -doo. Okay, you know what? If I'm seeing, I hope Caterpie's in this game. Caterpie Ooh. is one of my favorite Pokemon because of the episode where the shrieking and the hot pants. Yes. Well, I, well, the hot pants is because of the shrieking. Because <laughs> the episode where Misty's mean to him, it made me cry when I was little because I thought it was sad. Here we go! This is the big step, you know. My first step, my first step, to becoming the next champion! Guess I'll probably train up Sob a little bit by having a battle against Pokemon in this tall grass. If you push him down that slope, he might roll for a while. You should get yourself to the building with a purple roof and a great red and white ball mark out front. The Pokeball? The Pokeball? You're talking about the Pokeball? <laughs> like he doesn't recognize it. <laughs> That's the Pokemon Research Lab. We got this far without knowing what a Pokemon was. A Pokeball I was. Is that where? Is that where our professor is? I hate this child. There's a line of what the f Wooloo. They're not gonna let me through. This is the Wooloo Mafia. You want to wake up the sweet sleeping Wooloo, right? You better take the long way around. Take the long way. Get all the way. get all the items over here. Oh what? wait, wait, wait. Oh, you wait, can see them wait. in the world. I don't. I don't. I don't like that. You don't like that? No. I love that. <gasps> What's that? Is that a little fox? Oh, yeah. That's a chipmunk. Do you want to see it? Let's go see no, it. that's a fox. Oh my god. Oh, that's cute. He's neat. Nick it. Because <laughs> he's a fox. He's gonna steal your shit. Swiper no swiping. <laughs> Swiper no swiping. Nick it. Swiper's um, sister or something. I don't know what kind of type he is. So I'm gonna start it up oh, with- He's got a hail- His tail's a little hand. So he can nick it. I wonder if- I, think. I wonder if he's- like, <laughs> you stabbed got any eye. special stealing powers? <laughs> I don't like our, I don't like our Pokemon in the eye stick attack, which is our only attack of our type so far. Well, if it's if it's our type, it's stronger because it, it's it's uh, more yeah, powerful it's if we stab. use it. Yeah, I learned that word eventually. What a weird looking tail! It looks like it's, it looks like it's a Placo. 
<laughs> like it's a little Placo tail that's like, <laughs> all over the Aww. floor trying to feed. Keith's learning about fish. Yeah. A Placo. Floop. Pacostimos. I like the part where the Pokemon shrank into a tiny particle and fell through the world. <laughs> It, what just, a, what it a ceases to exist. What a confusing, distressing, horrific death animation. That is. Oh, I learned taunt. They, um, just, they just shrink out of existence and vanish. And there's the new boring fish. I mean, boring bird. Oh no! Okay. Whoa. Yeah, I love being able to see Pokemon. In the um, field. I guess I do kind of like. Because you can kind of choose your battles better. Pick your battles literally. Or dodge them when you want to. Well, go Paralyze heals. It heals paralyzed, dummy. <laughs> That's just, that's just, is that a normal blue? That's just description. Oh, I, I thought that was just. I didn't think. No, that's a fight. That's one you can catch. Okay. If you don't have any Pokeballs, you loser. So they got, they got the creepy sheep eyes. Keith, I'm gonna let you decide. What? Um, which ones? Oh, taunt. What is taunt? A special move? Taunt had like what a color. Whoa. I should look up. I should look if it. I don't know. Should what do you mean it? by special move? Like it had a instead of being a uh, white, meaning it's like a regular attack, it had like a blue. Oh, it's dark. Oops. It's a shadow attack. You think that's what that is? Yeah, the moon. I played. I <laughs> I played, po this I played Pokemon this year. <laughs> well, I don't. I don't. I never. I didn't play any that had the little symbol. On yeah, the... that's that's dark. I think. <laughs> right in the I, face. I think Psychic looks like something else. I think it's a spiral or something. Uh, well, back in the day, <laughs> all my Pokemon cards were purple, and they had the little eyeball with like a little weird spiral thing in it. But I... I we want, did it. I just want to brag. We just need to go get Pokeballs so we can actually start, you know, doing the thing that's the premise. Yeah. Well, we're, 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 right now we're just beating up animals. Well, it's called, it's called, it's called grinding, Keith, okay? Yeah, we're grinding living creatures into so mulch. So can I skip these people? No, go back. Uh, I want to get Pokeballs from the Poke building. Center. Yeah, but the po okay. We'll go, uh, oh, wait, I guess, we, can do, we can do both. Well, I guess he, oh, man. You're trapped now. <laughs> well done. You've reached the goal and managed to find the Pokemon Research oh, Lab. Oh, hi, Charizard. You did a uh, far be uh, You did a far sight better than I did my first time. I'm hopeless with directions. It's okay, you Leon. Walking across an open field where you can see your goal the whole time. Keith, <laughs> you don't know what it's like, okay? No one knows what it's like. I would get lost to too. get fucking lost hopelessly, and everyone laughs at you because you're blind. <laughs> I told you, I left paper towels in the bathroom because I was on my way to put them in the kitchen and then I got distracted because <laughs> I had to pee and then I left them in the bathroom and then... You just lost them. Yeah. <laughs> and then Eric found them. And then someone else, and then uh, other housemate refilled the paper towels and then we had an extra <laughs> because I had pulled one out from the cupboard and like brought it halfway there. So we had to put it back and I felt really sad. Okay, anyways. <laughs> I know I'm sure I'm... I'm sure glad I've got Charizard with me to keep me from getting lost all the Is time. It because he can fly above your head and see where you're going? Now, in we go. Growr. Yep, sounds exactly like that. Go ahead and just Growr. dub that over Charizard's roar when he's got his head stuck when he's got his head stuck in the wall in, in the pipe in the Pokemon first movie. Oh yeah. And just put that Stephanie noise over it. Oh Magnolia! We gotta give it to Professor Magnolia. We gotta give it to Professor Magnolia. Everything in here looks fascinating. I don't think you even know how to read. <laughs> <laughs> Bowark! No, Bowark. Is it a dog? <clears throat> Is it a dog? Oh, oh my god! It's a corgi! It's a corgamon. <laughs> oh, it's electric. It's got an electric oh my tail. God. It's got an electric tail. It's got a little thunder tail. Do you want it, Keith? Do I want it? Whoa. What? Look at that steez. Steez? That's that's her, right? Isn't that Magnolia? What does Steez mean? Why aren't you reading anything? Oh, sorry. <laughs> I'm trying to think of what Steez means. The style. Oh, I've never heard that before. Got that mad Steez. Oh my gosh. I don't think I ever want to hear that again. I wish, hear it I wish you'd stop for the rest of this place. These outlandish requests and those outlandish <laughs> words, Keith. Steez. Yeah. Who the fuck says that? Me, just now. <laughs> you heard me. Don't validate me. Is it got a heart on its butt? Good to see you too, <laughs> Yamper. Does it have a heart on its butt? Yamper here is a real champ when it comes to helping you find your way around. Is that his name or is that his Pokemon name? I don't know. He came to my rescue plenty of times back in the day when I got lost on the road. He's pretty cute. Oh, yeah. And that's his trainer, Sonia. Oh, so is that not? So that's Sonia, not Magnolia. Son Sonia Magnolia? Sonia be... Magnolia. 
Silver Magnolia. Well, I like the way she cooks. All right. Okay. <laughs> no other nice things to nice say. Nice sharing. She makes food you can gobble down in a flash. What kind of introduction is that? Did you forget we were rivals during our gym challenge? It wasn't just Yamper helping you out. I did too. I kind of agree with Sonya here. Look at the little guy. Anyway, nice to meet you. Name's Sonya. I'm the professor's assistant. Look at my impossible hair. Right. This is Keithany. She's a new Pokemon trainer. Set right on the per set her on the right path, would you? He's cute. He's pretty cute. I, oh I my like God! Look at the little tail. You can see that his little like mane was like fizzling out with little lightning bolts. That's great. Ah. <sighs> What does he think I am? He's always got this- his head in the clouds. It's no wonder he gets lost all the time. Oh, looks like you've got a Rotom phone. Oh, Rotom. Rotom? Hey, hey there, Rotom. What? Oh my god. Bzzz. The fuck is that? That's a Pokemon. Oh, Rotom kind phone. Of, uh, is it, I mean, it, I would- so, it seems like it'd be a, a Pokemon, right? Rotom's got- he's electric, right? But he's got like different forms. He has like one that's a washing machine, so it's water. He has one that's like a, a lawnmower, so it's grass. He has one where- he's like different like electronics that he is, and then the type depends on the electronic that he is. What the hell? It's pretty cool. Rotom phones are handy little things, aren't they? They've got a map and a navigation tool. And yeah, in the on the DS game, the Rotom like would talk to you. He's like on the bottom screen, and like you'd tap on it, and he was what like- he was hell? he was your interface. It's cool. This is bizarre. That said, Leon still gets lost, so... Oh. So he's, that means- that... What? That means it's not even our first Pokemon. Technically, no. You already had a Pokemon. Well, we had a... Whatever, we had, we had a, a, a we Munch... We had a fucking Apple Pokemon. We had a Munchlax. <laughs> Brought to us by Steve Jobs. Fucking ass Pokemon. Oh, sorry. So tell me, do you know a lot about Pokemon? Fuck yes, so don't explain anything. Fuck yes. No, stop talking to me. Leave me alone. <laughs> well said. Weird heart lady. In that case, I'll make it so you can use the Pokedex on your Rotom phone. Thanks, friend. The game immediately cuts out 80% of its dialogue. Look uh, at his heart uh, butt! You see his heart butt? See, in the in the other game, you say... Like, there are ones like where you say yes, and they still explain it anyway. And you're like, <sighs> Just so you know, that Pokedex is a gift from my gran. My gran. Could you let Gram know that you received the Pokedex? Smell you later, Gramps. Smell you later, Gran. Oh, it's a grandma this time. She lives in the house down along Route 2. Ah, is she Gary? <laughs> no. Is no. she no, if, Gary? If, if she game? was Gary, she would, she would say something mean about her grandma. Yeah. Look up this. Hello, random bar chart. Measuring something that's totally vital. Whoa, what is that? What is the tablets down here? Yeah, I can't. There's I can't weird uh, stuff happening do everywhere. anything fun with them. Can you go upstairs and steal from her? Yes <laughs> Just steal her belongings. Oh, nope. Oh, just... you, you looked up for a second there. Oh, the oh. gigantification of Pokemon While the general principle holds that Pokemon grow stronger and larger by evolving It also is true that simply making oneself appear larger is another survival strategy with merit. Oh, so those like so in case you didn't know, this Pokemon game has, uh... Gigamax. Has making it goes your... Dynamax. Dynamax, making your Pokemon huge. This phenomenon. So apparently they only the look Dynamax huge. phenomenon, in which Pokemon take on gigantic forms, has only been observed in the Galar region. Moreover, it seems to occur in specific locations under set conditions. Yeah. Okay. It's called colonialism. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. What was yeah. this? These plants are take... Uh, take a great deal of care, but they all seem to be flourishing. Cool. So she never leaves here. Yamp yamp. <laughs> I like you. Look at him. Ow! What does it evolve into? I don't know. Yamper. We haven't looked. <laughs> a yampier. Yamper. I won't. I won't look anything up. So we'll, we'll what is experience that? it together. Hey there, trader. Sorry to stop you. Stranger danger. You just left the Pokemon lab, right? That means you've got a Pokedex, yeah. Uh, put it in the bag or else. Yeah. Put it in the bag or the, or the yamper gets it. <laughs> <laughs> I love talking to new trainers and giving them useful stuff. That voice is really suiting. Oh, you hey. He's a potion. He just fucking oh, hit free stuff. You <laughs> hook? <laughs> it's a potion. Use it with your Pokemon's HP. Their hit points gets low. Oh, yes, explain HP my... <laughs> is like a Pokemon stamp. I heard you like. I heard you knew everything about Pokemon already, Stephanie. Would you like to have every detail explained to you in great detail? No. <laughs> you could even use potions during battle. 
Not if you're playing a Nuzlocke. Knowledge Nuzlocke. is power. It's a great idea to talk to lots of different people and read everything you can on your journey. Yeah, if I, if I was playing this and not on, on, on camera, I would just be like, a a a a a Yeah, a. yeah like I said, sorry everyone, if I skip dialogue, I it, it's so inherent. I, I literally just... Until it's done. Why do you have a squirrel in here? Because they're Pokemon, I, Stephanie. I know, I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. I just Jesus. I just don't like that one. I already don't like it. You already don't like it? It's got a dumb face. But its name's incredible. Remember? Yeah. Whatever that was. What was it? It was... <laughs> Why is it, it, has, it has a bone. It has a bone here. Yeah, that's confusing. I, got, I like that it's got the for as far as squirrels go, it's got the little tuft on its ear, where it's got the little like V of tuft. Uh, she just told me where Professor Magnolia is. The fighter at her home down the front end of route You just walked two. in here and turned her TV on and left. <laughs> Weirdo. Yeah. <laughs> I just remember what the sign here used to hey, say. Hey Andrew, how you doing? <laughs> to the you, right- You seem taller. I'm gonna give you a masculine voice, Andrew. To the right is the Pokemon lab. On the opposite side is the station. You're welcome. Wedge hearse. Makes me want cheese. Like a wedge of cheese. A wedge of cheese. Yep. I, I, this this writing is a thing. Do you think you can translate it? Do you think it's an alphabet? Um, like an, no. Like Hylian? Hylian? I really. Oh, hey. <gasps> uh, no, I want, poke, I want Pokeballs. None of those are no. what you want? Nope. Look, it's all the status effect healers that I never take with me. <laughs> uh, yeah, honestly, just poke, poke I don't Center. Know, Brian, is it you? Who's this boy? The world you see out the window of a train. It never stops changing. Isn't it lovely? Mm, yeah, I don't know you. You eventually ride uh, to the same train, and then you're like, oh, it's a rerun. <laughs> I saw Leon at the station. He has such a powerful presence, I recognized him before he even got close. That Charizard, Charizard pose! pose. <laughs> Just doing the pose along with Leon makes me feel like I've gotten stronger. Jesus. Well, get good. Just get good yourself. Uh, let me know if- I'm really excited to play this, so let yeah. me know if I'm being annoying. No. Okay. 